Hello, and welcome to Let Me Be Frank. I will be your special guest host today, Jack. And we'll be looking at the free Steam game available now called Bloody Walls. Uh, this game came out in September of 2016. Uh... But people are playing it right now because there's more DLC coming out currently. So it's about a half a year old, but there's more DLC and people are playing it, so I wanted to take a look at it. It's a 2D side-scroller shoot-em-up where these zombie-looking creatures are fighting you on every level of this bunker dungeon game. So the original game comes with 10 levels um, where you go down each level. It's It's... And they, the difficulty increases on each level. So here is the first level where you're shooting up a couple zombies. And at the end of each level, there's an item that you find. And you bring it back to the first level and give it to someone. And they give you more weapons and more items to use during your gameplay while you're going down this elevator. Uh, so what I like about this game is the graphics is, are pretty great. I, lo I love the retro pixelated stuff, and that comes out in this game. I love that the when there's blood splatter all over the walls, kind of the namesake of the game. It's just visually appealing in general. The, play the characters are pretty simple looking, but it's enjoyable for that. Uh, this is a good thing and a bad thing about this game, is that it's pretty simple. You can see that I just shoot them in the head, and they eventually die. So that's a good thing. And a bad thing about this game is that it's pretty simple, straightforward. You point and click, you side scroll, and you just go down the levels. Um, some bad things I don't really like about this game is that they're very limited weapons. Right now you can see that I have a shotgun and the simple machine gun. And there's only an SMG and some grenades and some bombs. So that's that's it for weapons. Uh they, they do work, and I like the shotgun the best, but very limited. And also, this game is very short. I beat the game, all 10 levels, in about 45 minutes. I feel like I could have done it even faster if I didn't die at the end once. <laughs> so, it's very short for the original game. But like I was saying, there's DLC coming out right now, and I don't know how long that is. But for the original game itself, very short. And... And every time you die, you have to restart. So that's their way of lengthening the game in total. But it's not a good way to lengthen a game, is that you have to restart every time. I like the designs of the zombies. They're very interesting. Some broccoli guys, some bloody guys. Uh, and if you like to paint some wall with some blood, this is the game for you. A, a quick time waster. I'd probably only rate it like a 5 or a 6. At best, maybe with the DLC, it's about a six. Uh, if you just want to waste about an hour, here's Bloody Walls. Uh, go check it out. Maybe check out our channel for some more video game action coming very soon. <laughs>